course, the Victoria Day Parade attracts large crowds of spectators, but it's also a big draw for groups and organizations, many marching with a message, including the War Amps Child Amputee Program. High school marching bands also play a big role in the parade each year, traveling from all over the region, including many from the U.S. Marching bands from Canada and the U.S. are always a big hit in the Victoria Day Parade. The Shorewood Marching Band from Shoreline, Washington, are one of several high schools taking part this year. And before the marching begins, Mary Hall with the Esquimalt Lions Club makes sure everyone knows just where to go. I love it. I love it. Several groups and organizations are marching with a message. This year marks the 35th anniversary of the War Amps Child Amputee Program, or CHAMP. A lot of these children have lost arms and legs in accidents that could have been prevented. So by sharing that message along the parade route in the, one of the biggest parades in British Columbia, the Victoria Day Parade, we're able to uh, not only uh, support what we do as an organization, but also get a good, solid message out to uh, all the parade goers. We say play safe, drive safe, and we wave and smile. And Did you have a lot of fun? Yes, I had a lot of fun. But were you nervous? A little bit. It's really fun to spread the message and um, tell them to play safe. And at noon precisely, members of 5 Field Regiment fire a 21-gun royal salute, a ceremony dating back to the late 1800s. It celebrates the birthday of Queen Victoria, which Queen Elizabeth took on as her official birthday. This salute happens all across Canada, all the capital cities across Canada. It all happens at noon, local time. It has actually nothing to do with the Victoria Day Parade. It's just on the same day. Bombardier Conquest is a reservist with five field unit. He's just returned from Afghanistan, where he has been serving for the past seven months. The ceremony to me shows that uh, we do have a part in society and we're not just people who go out into the middle of nowhere to countries where people may not like us, do not like us, and are shooting at us. And that's what keeps us fighting, to show that people back here uh, know that we're around and appreciate our presence and our contribution. This year's Victoria Day Parade also has special significance for the Naden Band, cadets and all sailors, as they celebrate the Naval Centennial.